Hello friends, my name is uh, Professor M. Asaram. I am basically fitness freak. I served in the Indian Air Force. I was uh, bedridden during the second wave of coronavirus in the year uh, 2021 uh, due to brain stroke. I do a couple of uh, exercises to get back to normal self. I was born in a toxic family and grew up in a toxic environment. My life is full of struggles and sufferings. I am uh, lucky to survive after the brain stroke. For more than a year, uh, I am doing the physiotherapy exercises and the doctors have advised me that I have to do physiotherapy exercises for one more year. My philosophy in life is health first, education second, and wealth third. My vision is to build 1 million students as global leaders by 2030. So far, I have trained more than 50,000 students as global leaders. After the coronavirus, things have changed, so I started sharing my knowledge freely with the world on various social media platforms, including YouTube and LinkedIn. My right hand was paralyzed. I am trying my very best to get back to normal scene with my big power. My right shoulder is numb and there is no sense to my right shoulder. Sometimes I am stammering, sometimes I am forgetting after the brain stroke. I was a college dropout. In this of 18, I joined the Indian Air Force. I acquired a couple of uh, qualifications, including PME, DSC, MBA, MBA PGTC, LM, PGTPA, and I had my PhD in soft skills in the year 2011. So I am a self made man. And, uh, I grew despite uh, being born in a toxic family and growing up in a toxic environment. I am grateful to Indian Air Force that I came out of my toxic family members. I am always grateful to Indian Air Force for grooming me as a healthy citizen. On an average, I am doing uh, physiotherapy exercises for uh, two hours in a day. And two hours in a day, I am going for a walk. And six hours in a day, I am sitting with the internet. I am basically a creative writer, but I am not able to write because of uh, health issues. I have mental 
Jalan Bos, physical charity, financial charity, but I am not giving up. Dr. Swab said that I have to get, but I survived after my brain stroke. So I am grateful to God for giving one more opportunity to give and add value to others, especially for students. I am passionate about the learning, I am passionate about sharing my knowledge really with the world, especially with students. Never ever give up, keep inspiring others, everything is possible, create your own destiny, your life is in your hands, don't blame others, don't stay with others, take responsibility and move on, move on life, take valuable take your, take your lives. <laughs> I have authored more than 50 books, including the award winning book titled See the Writing Book, for which he sold as the Lama has written a poor word. Total 60 books are written, 50 books have been published, and 10 books are yet to be published. Uh, still, work is pending. Hopefully, I'll be get. I'll be, I'll be getting back to normalcy and I'll be able to write books. My mission is to build 1 million students as global leaders and Dr. Kiran Vidin has written a foreword for my book titled Mission 2030, 1 million global leaders. And I have dedicated this book to Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam because I admire him very much. Follower of uh, Swami Vivekananda. Abraham Lincoln is uh, my inspiration, and uh, Mahatma Gandhi is also my inspiration. I read uh, lots of books in the lifetime, and the Varasas reader. I'm dyslexic, and uh, I have ADHD, attention deficit hyperactivity disorder which is also known as chaos order, uh, that means uh, sometimes I get uh, tension. So despite uh, health uh, issues and uh, despite uh, uh, limitations, I am not giving up and I am trying my best to add value to others. <coughs> challenges. Challenges help you think out of the box and the challenges uh, help you stretch and the challenges help you grow as a resilient leader. Challenges help you grow as a great leader. So be positive and be optimistic. I want to write a uh, uh, Namaya or my autobiography to share my challenges and how I have led my life despite financial challenges and other challenges. And also, I will share with the world how I was betrayed by family members and some of our relatives. And I want to inspire the world. I want to share my personal story and journey to add value to others.
life is full of uh, struggles and sufferings. I am not giving up. I have a chronic problem with my right uh, shoulder. But still I am not giving up. So you should never ever give up. You have to fight till the last moment. The message from this uh, video is that we are gifted with a limited uh, time span on this planet. Identify the challenges which are very close to your heart and address the challenges, serve others and make a difference in the lives of others. Thank you for subscribing to my YouTube channel.